Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you're new or here, then welcome. I'm Shami Krishna and this is my YouTube beauty space. I've done lip swatch video on the Colourpop liquid lipsticks. So I know most of you guys liked it. It did really well. And I was like, why not I do a part two of Colourpop lip swatches? So today I'll be swatching different formulations of uh, different formulas of Colourpop liquid lipsticks. So they have their lippy sticks ultra satin liquid lipsticks they have their ultra matte liquid lipsticks so i also will be doing a small review kind of a thing and it's not uh, don't worry i don't i won't take a lot of time but in case you guys want to skip the review and everything i will mention it in the description box as well as the comment section uh where you can skip the timings and everything uh, and you can directly go and see the swatches so lipsticks are really drying and um yeah they are very uh, they're kind of ultra matte lipsticks they're totally matte and a few shades are kind of has a satiny finish but few shades are totally matte the lippy sticks are very good but if you have dry lips then those wouldn't suit you uh those wouldn't be flattering on you on your chapped or dried lips and yeah they do dry out your lips as well so coming to the ultra satin lips ultra satin lips are one of i think one of the best formulas of uh, color pop is one of my favorite so coming to the pros of them they're very very uh they're very kind of you know they have that matte finish which i love i love my matte lip, uh, lipsticks so they still give it matte finish but without drying your lips they also kind of hydrate your lips they do not dry out your lips and they you know kind of make your looks uh, uh looks okay they kind of make your lips look plumper and fuller and uh yeah i, I it just gives a poutier finish and that's what i totally love but i just have one issue with them so i wouldn't suggest them if you are going to you know have lunch or dinner or somewhere eating i wouldn't uh, suggest you guys to wear those especially the darker shades because they are very 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 they transfer like crazy okay and uh, the pigmentation again they have that too pigmented so it's not like if you just wipe they just go they do stain and uh, that is the con and coming to the ultra matte lips you guys know i love ultra matte lips and uh, but again the formula is very drying and uh, you can't wear them for long hours they are not that comfortable and also one major issue with uh, ultra matte lipsticks is that initially they're like fine they're the same color but as the time goes like after uh especially like you know uh after one hour or so they get darker they get darker than they're supposed to be and this usually happens with fairer skin tone people so uh, so my sister is fair and she has pink lips so whenever she wears like any color pop lipstick it kind of like turns so dark almost and especially the colors like teal and everything it, it almost turns to a point where it, it looks black on her like, i have even seen like uh you know color change even for me uh there are few uh, there are sometimes like whenever i've worn for long hours and stuff it has changed color so yeah that is again on uh one of the con and coming to the pros as Colourpop itself a Colourpop as a brand it's very very affordable you guys know that and uh, they are very quick they they manufacture really quick they have a ton of shades the pigmentation is really good um the they are very very affordable and um they are actually comparable to most of uh, the high-end lipsticks especially people compare them to Kylie's and I kind of even had the feeling a little bit especially with few lip lipsticks of hers they are also drying on the lips like if you just wear her li uh, liquid lipsticks instead of using her pencil um, they are drying and they just felt the same for me so I think that's it for my very short and sweet review and yeah without further ado let's just jump to the swatches
enjoy this video if you did then please give this video a big thumbs up and if you're here and if you're not yet subscribed then yeah, the subscribe button is just down below and you can be the part of our slay family also in case you guys want to follow me out of this youtube because i do a lot of behind the scenes if you want to like kind of keep up with me and stuff like that all the links to my social media handles will always be mentioned in the description box down below as i always say keep slaying love you all bye mm.